All right, guys, hey, thanks for joining me today. The Greater Minnesota Soil Health Expo 2020, or John Stevens Field Day, whatever you want to call it, it's happening on the 21st. I'll put an address to the farm in the description, and then you just drive past the farm, and then it's just another driveway down in the middle of the alfalfa field, and you'll pull in. We'll have signs, don't worry. And uh, so I'm going to do an opening monologue of how I got started, some of the things we've learned, and some of the things that have been successful, and where we hope to go. And then uh, just a quick introduction of the five principles of soil health. And the, the really, the, the thing this year is we're not gonna have just extensive in-depth financial analysis and comparisons and talks. Because this year, the theme that we want people to think about is what if. What if it could work on your farm? Think of things that cause you stress on your farm and think of things that might cause a financial hardship on your farm. And is there anything that we're gonna learn on that day that you can take home to maybe save five or 10 bucks an acre or uh, reduce a little bit of mental stress? Uh, if nothing else, we're gonna have a great dinner and a great day of camaraderie with other farmers to, to just cry on each other's shoulders for this year. And then we've got a wonderful speaker from the U for pasture and cattle. We got another gal on bugs like, like rootworm and SCN and soil life and soil health. Um, and then we've got Anna with SHP, fantastic speaker, sharp, sharp gal. Um, and then we will have the rain simulator, we'll have the planter and the strip till. So the rain simulator and the planter and the strip till are going to kind of all tie into a, a conversation. It's not just going to be a rain simulator and look at the jars. As soon as that rain simulator is done, then uh, we're going to talk about, we're going to stomp on that ground. We're going to get a couple chunks of soil for shovel testing and, and have some of them little displays. And then we're going to talk about when you get into good healthy structured soil with your planter the changes of fertility management as far as application and timing and placement uh, making sure that planter can maintain depth that it can close the slot things like that how to do your own strip till or what to what to expect out of doing strip till and uh, on the rain simulator i do have some of the most famous soil from minnesota from west central minnesota i got some of the most famous black dirt it's too cold it's too wet it don't work your soil i grabbed a couple bushels when i was driving around minnesota this summer so i dumped it out in the pasture in a pile so it's had all summer to just heal up and uh, do its thing so we'll get a pan of that in the rain simulator as well and uh, so that should be kind of cool because it's soil like we don't see around here um, so that'll be kind of fun and then after a lot of in-depth conversation about fertility management, planting, all that kind of stuff, then we've got the 60-inch corn conversation of why I'm doing it, where I think my cash flow is going to be, and where I hope to take it in the future, because that's an ever-evolving system right there as well. And uh, so it's going to be a jam-packed day. Uh, my mom's going to make us a wonderful pork pulled pork lunch, and... Uh, or maybe I'll make it. I'll make it. All right, all right. I'll make us a wonderful pulled pork lunch, and uh, and we'll go from there. But yeah, so that's that's what you can expect when you come here this day. And there's going to be a lot of great people. There's going to be farmers in the audience that have tried stuff themselves, and so people who just bounce ideas off each other. I don't care if you make a great connection with somebody that you're standing next to and walk off away from the exhibit so your conference your conversation doesn't bug the show that's going on and you two grab a couple chairs and just work with each other uh like hey i i worked on this me too and 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 make that connection and go off go off to the side and solve whatever you need to solve that's what it's all about guys that's what it's all about and uh so yeah I'm, I'm getting very nervous and very excited at the same time, and uh, I hope it's a great show. With COVID, I have no idea. I've been asking people to RSVP, and so I, I don't know. It, 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 I, 
Are you going to have 200 people or are we going to have 10 people? If 10 people show up, it's going to be a show of their lifetime. And uh, if 200 people show up, it's going to be a show of my lifetime. And so I'll be too nervous to speak. I'll just be like... Uh, 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 uh. And so, yeah, guys, on that note, I'll leave you go. And thank you very much for watching.